Caroline Flack's biography will hit the shelves in weeks shortly after the television star's death. The former Love Island host took her life aged 40 in her London flat on Saturday just weeks before her upcoming trial. Carolyn's final hours were spent with friends on Valentine's Day evening amid claims she had warned police she would kill herself. In the wake of the news, the biography will be shuttled out as quickly as possible to meet demands on April 30. It has been titled Caroline. The short, sweet, and tragic life of Caroline Flack. Carolyn's turbulent love life and high, flying showbiz career always courted the attention of headlines during her time in the limelight. Journalist Emily Herbert will form the story of the reality television personality's life on the page. John Blake's new firm Ad Lib Publishing will be releasing the non-fiction title to fans. He said of the project, Emily is wonderful writer who has serious and important things to say about this terrible tragedy. She will reveal much that is unknown about this. Sad, sad story. In January this year, Blake launched his new non-fiction publisher which will be run in partnership with Palazzo Editions. Caroline had dropped her own autobiography detailing the intimate details of her life in 2015. The Strictly Come Dancing winner released her book Caroline Flack, Storm in Cup just year after her win on The Dancing Show. Always wearing her heart on her sleeve, the telly star spilled all about her on screen TV career as well as her family background. The news comes fast. After it hit headlines Caroline had taken her own life in her London flat over the weekend. Flack had been due to stand trial on March after she was charged with assault by beating. Her arrest and subsequent charge followed an alleged row with her boyfriend Louis Burton at her home. She pleaded not guilty while Louis maintained her innocence and begged the CPS to drop the charges. Caroline had stepped down from her hosting duties on the first ever Winter Love Island but ITV bosses were said to have left the door open for her. Return to her hosting post for the summer series. Close pal Laura Whitmore stepped up to fill her spot on the show and she led the tearful tributes to her friend after her death. Celebs have poured their heart, warming words about Carolyn's sparkly personality on social media. It's believed she was given clinical assessment by paramedics at her flat on Valentine's Day, just one day before she died.